Yes, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new episode of Halal Munchies. I think I've reviewed a lot of the takeaways in uh, Birmingham, but we haven't reviewed this spot. Let me let me go a bit closer. Let me zoom up just behind me right now. I don't know you can see. How much can you see of that? Can you see? Maybe my angles are a bit wrong. Classic, classic kebab house on Witten Road, Aston, Birmingham. I've got my food. To be fair, I, I'm in a bit of a rush. I've really, 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 really quick done the TikTok. Uh, I'm going to the car to do the full YouTube review. Look, that's commitment. Then I gotta zoom off to somewhere. So if you're new here, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. What have I ordered? I've ordered some wings, a pound fifty for six. Bloody cheap, man. Um, I'm not gonna spoil it too much because I've uh, given my kind of review on TikTok already. And uh, aside from the wings, we also got not two piece chicken and chips, just one piece chicken and chips. I swear that was like two pounds fifty. So overall, my meal cost me four quid. And that's kind of like two, man, I'm a big lad. That's kind of two munches in one. So let's go to the car. Let's review it. Classic kebab house on Witten Road, Aston, Birmingham. Okay, guys, now we've got the angle. I think it's time to tuck in. We're going to start off with the two piece chicken and chips because that was the closest to me. There'll see, be some panning shots on the screen right now of this. But it's, uh, yeah, it's, it, I don't know how I'm going to show you up to the camera because it's a bit, yeah, you're just going to see, you're just going to see, uh, you're just going to see wrap. So let's start off with the chips. They're a little bit colder because I've just walked a few bits to the car. Bismillah. Yeah, you know what? There's no need to be overly harsh because that's like the the kind of standard you'd look for. I told him to put chili and mayo on the side. I'm one of them ones. So let me find a piece. Oh, here's the mayo. Let's get some mayo first. There we are. Getting the mayo. It's good. Oh, that was a good chip. Fluffy, a little bit crispy on the outside. Good potato content. I like the mayo though. It's good. Let me try and find... A, oh, here we go. I've got the corner where they put the, the chili sauce. Yeah. There we are. Let's get that in the gob. You know what, guys? Fair play. Fair play. Chunky chips. So the chili sauce has got a bit of a sweetness kick. You're concluded by a bit of a sweetness kick. So I don't want to say it's a, I don't want to say it's a sweet chili, but it's um. It's nice. You know what, guys? I have not had a two-piece chicken and chips, or in this case, one-piece chicken and chips, for a long time. That's a lie. I did last week. That is a lie. Speaking of chicken, check out that bad boy. And if I can't get a good angle on this one right now, there'll probably be a padding shot on the screen right now. Let's take a good old bite on this uh, chicken. Here we go. That was a very good bite. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Crunchy butter. Somewhat juicy chicken. Decent amount of spices on that butter. I mean, this food, guys, is not fine dining. It's like you grew up eating it, if that makes sense. Usually, people don't judge a kebab house or a fish and chips house shop on uh, just chicken they also check out the chicken wings and they also check out the fish and chips i didn't get fish and chips oh yeah by the way guys there's a fair amount of seating and you can go in there you can go in there you can sit down you can chill with the boys you can or girls uh just have a nice meal they do a lot of grilled stuff there'll be some shots on the screen again of the grilled stuff um you know and i think they batch cook it like a lot of places do so you see a lot of chicken wings a lot of niblets and you'll see a lot of fried chicken there uh, i didn't get any shots of um i didn't get any shots of the fish but there was a, there's like 18 19 pieces of fish just ready to go there so not exactly cooked to order but yeah decent now let's move on to the wings okay folks we are gonna try um if i can open it the the wings now these are the wings let me get in that. Let me, you know, there you are. You get six in a portion. They're fairly big. Let me get you a close up. They'll probably be, again, a panic shot on the screen right now. Uh, those are the wings right there. They're not the, they're not the best looking in the world. They're, they're all right. They're all right. And you get six in there. There's a, there might be a bone in there. Or oh, I've just absolutely downed one for my TikTok. Uh, I think I had two, I think. Not too sure. Uh, there you are. I'm not sure how you can see of that. And then we are just going to munch these down. I'm about them for TikTok. And what I'm thinking is if those were fresh, those will be absolutely 
banging wings really really nice but yeah man i'm not i can't do that thing where people just put it in your mouth and it comes out with two bones it, it probably would help if they were fresh but they batch cook it which is fine it's chicken and chips man for that pro, pro, talk about price point one pound fifty for six that's crazy now oh, here we go mm, yeah man mm, big saltiness kick a very big saltiness kick and that tells you it's cooked well. I hope they freshly butter the wings because you know what? They're decent in size too. They're not mass. They're not tiny. Okay, I've had tiny wings and I've paid paid like quadruple or five times the price. Do you know what I mean? So, as always, let's go for another one. Clean, not the juiciest chicken, just like the fried chicken I had previously. But the butter, it's got a nice crunch to it. I like it that it's salty. I really like it because it's salty. It's not... Here we go. This is a plus point. Not excessively oily, which is good. I'm parked on some side road. There's a few people nodding their head out because, you know, it's dark. Apologies about the lighting. I decided to review these guys after Mugrib and it's getting pretty dark. A lot of people are looking at me. Henceforth, I'm going to finish the video here. If you're new here, be sure to like, comment and subscribe, please. We're doing fantastic. We want to get to 10k this year. That'd be absolutely amazing. Support the Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook and all that good jazz. I appreciate your support, guys. Check this place out. Classics, Witten Road, Aston, Birmingham. I had to think there. And I will see you in the next episode of Halal Munchies.